Hello there everybody and welcome back to our channel TechTube and we are back with another brand new video for you guys and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can fix your WhatsApp unable to connect try again later problem. So when you're trying or like when you're facing this problem every single time you try to send a message or you try to open your WhatsApp it's going to say unable to connect please try again later. So basically the core of this problem is WhatsApp has its server and every time you open WhatsApp it automatically connects to WhatsApp server and then only your WhatsApp works. But when you're facing the problem, your WhatsApp doesn't connect to WhatsApp server, which ultimately shows you this message called unable to connect, please try again later. So when you're facing this problem, basically you need to check your internet connection. As it says, you need to connect to WhatsApp server. So if you have a slow internet or unstable internet, it's going to show this problem. So the only way to fix this problem is to switch your internet to a data connection or switch to an internet connection which is stable. And the other way to fix this problem is before I tell you that way, just don't forget to hit the like and subscribe to our YouTube channel TechTube. Let's move on. The other way is want to go to your Play Store or App Store, depends on which phone you're using. I'm going to go on my Play Store and over here in search, I want to search for WhatsApp. After you search for WhatsApp, if it says open over here, you're good to go. It means your WhatsApp is up to date. But if it says update instead of open, it means you need to update your WhatsApp. And after updating your WhatsApp, try to open your WhatsApp. It should be fixed. Sometimes due to lack of update, your WhatsApp becomes too old for it to connect to WhatsApp server. So make sure to update it from time to time and it should work. If it still doesn't work, the other thing you can do is hold on the WhatsApp icon, click on App Info. After you click on App Info, go on where it says Data Usage Status. Once you go over here, make sure your background data is turned on and go on where it says Network Permission. Once you go over here, make sure Wi-Fi and mobile data is ticked over here, all right? Once you do that, it should work. If it still doesn't work, you need to come to storage usage. Click on clear catch. Once you do that, open your WhatsApp and it should open up. If it still doesn't open up, you need to click on clear data and clear the data of your WhatsApp. What this is going to do is this is basically like deleting and reinstalling your WhatsApp. All right. Just remember all the data stored on your WhatsApp is going to be deleted. So make sure to back it up before you do that. And if all the thing I said until now didn't work, just delete and reinstall your WhatsApp. It should probably work. But sometimes WhatsApp updates their servers. If you're trying to open your WhatsApp at that time, it's not going to work. And if you're trying to open WhatsApp at that time, the only way to fix it is wait until they fix their server. It's basically called maintenance break. So wait until their break is over and it should work. So just don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. Bye bye everybody.